Okay, everybody, it's the February 2nd Groundhog Day version of the American Idol uh, auditions from Austin, Texas. Just going to go through these quick. Uh, Corey Lavoie, uh, he's 21 years old, pretty cool tenor voice. I liked him. Um, who knows about a long-term potential. Holly Cavanaugh, she's 17. Uh, she got through on the second song. She's going to get eaten up in L.A. in Hollywood just because unless she can really focus her nerves. My voice is going in and out today, so... <clears throat> Whoops. Uh, John Wayne Schultz, I really liked him. He was a 23-year-old uh, country singer guy. Um, higher than the really good bass one that we heard the other day. Um, yeah, Courtney Penry, uh, the one... The chicken girl. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Um, or the I Love Ryan Seacrest girl. Um, you know, I, I like her voice. To a point, but uh, it's she's got to even it out because there's some good things and some some uh, things. I like what JLo said. Um, I, I also like the the golden ticket reveal. Um, then the next three people, they were the really short ones, like Chantal Campos, was really good, but you you heard like eight words, you know, and Caleb Johnson, um, Alex Carr. Uh, Caleb Johnson was the big Soundgarden guy. Alex Carr had the big 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 voice. Um, the uh, the couple was cute, Jacqueline Dunford and Nick Fink. I uh, liked both of their songs. Uh, Nick is a kind of a crooner, smooth baritone. Uh, Jacqueline, I liked her version of Mercy a lot. Um, Janelle Arthur, she's twenty, had a good sounding voice. Um, I liked she. There was something like there was a definite star quality there. There was something about the way she she looked and sounded together. It looked like that looked like something, you know. Big surprise for me of the night was Casey Abrams, the you know uh, the nineteen year old Seth Rogen looking Fraggle Rock looking guy with the weird you know vocoder whatever the heck it was voice harmonica. He was great. Um, he he was great. He he sounded so awesome. Sounded like. Um, Steven Tyler com combined with Bobby McFerrin, you know, uh, don't worry, be happy. Like, but if you know his other stuff, he's got so much, uh, versatility in his voice. I mean, he did all sorts of stuff in, you know, it, it maybe even too much, you know, but it was just great. And uh, I think he's definitely a, a top 10, uh, candidate, you know, more so than the, the Caleb Johnson dude. But um, the two people I like the most from this was definitely, you know, Casey Abrams and uh, Janelle Arthur. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's all for now. We'll see you tomorrow. Boo!